versus Bowser himself. Oh, Lord. It's the battle of the baddies. About between the heavies. It's about to go down right here. Let's go ahead and rock in. Game number one is upon us. Like what I'm seeing right here, Wiles. That's right, for y'all that don't know that I've been sleeping under a rock. This is one of the premier Kazias in the world. You about to see exactly why here if you don't believe. Nice, eight frames of pain. Nice. Boy, stop playing with me off this stage. Wow. Get out the corner. Yeah, not even opting for the electric into the double nair. They're actually going for the crouching jab into the nair. Oh, and the up B extension off the platform, getting that electric on the platform, making it so Bowser is going to get the KO'd a bit earlier here. And honestly, Wild's not taking that much damage. Only 65, and we almost got another down throw. Great DI coming out from Bluebell. That's right. Again, it's just the battle of the heavies, and it's just kind of, it's unfortunate, you know, Bowser a very, very big target, but there are parts of the matchup, too, where Bowser can really show oh. what he can bring to the table, and it ain't on the small part of the black platforms here, excuse me, on Pokemon Stadium. It starts with the offstage battle. As you can see right here, Ford Air, of course, taking no prisoners. A little off the mark, coming back through with the upper on Kazi's behalf, frame four option, and almost getting choked up and choked out. Yeah, you never want Kazi to take you off stage with that move especially with the stock lead and just like that. Bowser not going to be able to make it back. Bluebell kind of destroyed here by Wilds, but of course Wilds being one of the top seeds of this Momocon bracket. Yeah, I mean, he's just really primed in position to beat up your favorite player. I'm not surprised that he's doing what he's doing right now in this early portion of pools, but yeah. you really get to see Wilds come alive in those later portions of bracket where, I mean, you think because you don't really know much of him or that his... His resume might not be as stacked as some of your favorite players. You think, oh, there's no way he's going to do well. No, he's going to do better than well. He's going to do phenomenal. You're going to see here this weekend. Let's go ahead and get it. Game number two, Pokemon Stadium about to make it do what it do, Ski. I jump right over to fire. Eight frames of pain. There's the God Fist. Nice. Can I get another? Can I? Can I no, just do four. <laughs> Give me four. In the double win, God Fist, but no electric there. Double Nair. No, just the one Nair is enough. That's it, brother. Huh? That's all it takes. Body too big. You are a big target off stage. But wait a minute. Okay, he's gonna come through with the command grab forward here on the reset. Okay. Nice, I like that. Every time, because he knows that forward is usually gonna be the option in the corner, at least out of bounds yeah. of aerials to push him back off stage. So he always has upper on the ready back down. Jesus Christ! Jesus Jermaine Lamont Christ. <laughs> Jesus, fight back. That was quite the sequence we saw there from Wilds. Oh, big stun, big trip into the electric here, onto the platform. Tries to get the extension, but goes right back down. <laughs> the Bowser bomb, he's had enough. Yeah. He's trying to break up anything he can. These combos too strong, too powerful coming out from Wilds. You say you don't want none of this problem in the corner, especially, man. You really have to figure out a way to try to work around what Kai's is bringing to the table in the corner. It's a task easier said than done. But if there's a will, there's most certainly a way. Nice. And you can see right there, starting to figure some things out a little bit more. Of course, couldn't quite actually, you know, get the forwarder that he was looking for. But now he knows, okay, when it comes to the offstage presence, he's a little too aggressive at times. I might be able to sneak a forwarder in there towards Kazuya and maybe reset the situation in the corner. Man, this... Being a player that mains any of the fighting game characters, especially any of the Volatiles ones, like Kazuya, where you just kind of get one hit and you go to town, your, your round one pools matches must just be the most fun thing ever. You, it, it, it must feel like you're just in training mode, right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> just another day in training mode. Yep, <laughs> yep. Just recording content for my YouTube reels. Let me, just mm. get my, let me get this electric. Oh, let me try out this different route, you know. Yep, nothing out of the order. I don't need a double nair. I can go for the crouching jab, maybe mm -hmm. go this mm -hmm. different route. <laughs> Don't need to go for another God Fist. I can go from one hit of the Twin Piston, you know, reset right, you on the platforms, right. keep you going. Especially on Bowser. Yeah. Bowser's even... Yeah, he's, I mean, bro, when you want to... than a sandbag. No, that's facts, bro. I mean, when you want to, like, you know, style, you're going to style on a big character, and then after that, you're going to style on Captain Falcon. That's how it goes. It's like big characters beat them up. Yep. Captain Falcon, sandbag. Captain Falcon's next on the lineup. <laughs> yeah. Okay, but it might be Joker on the hit list here as well, depending on how this one all wraps up. Now, of course, Joker blessed with some really awesome tools. Of course, a much faster character than Bowser by a large margin. Um, of course, has the potency of Arsene. Has a little bit more safety in their aerials, too. I know Nair frame 12, so kind of slow, but minus 5 on shield if spaced properly. So you can approach a little. Oh, goodness. You don't want to approach that way, though. Jesus, man. Sent them sky high. I mean, at least... At least not as bad as the Ugh. Bowser. Electric in a forward smash? like Jesus Christ, bro. That happened multiple times against Bowser. That was messed up. Yeah, it, it was nothing nice. <laughs>
But looking a little bit more at home here with the Joker, and more yes. importantly, a little bit more confident, too. Being able to go off stage in a way that you just really can't do with Bowser. Nice. Delay on the flash punch. It's going to come through with the dash attack again, forcing this corner. And if you guys have played any version of Tekken, I don't care if it's one tag, one tag, two, doesn't matter. You get your <laughs> opponent against the wall or in the corner, they are in some real trouble. Oh, yeah, that that's a classic in most fighting games. Finally gets the air dodge, finally gets a stock. Bluebell coming through, and this Joker is doing a lot of work. Like we were just saying before, I mean, I, I, even if Bowser is your best character, it might just be a tough draw when it comes to Mr. Mishima. No, that's facts. I mean, he's good at beating up big old characters. The opening of Tekken 5 was him beating up Jack 5s and 4s, so... <laughs> I mean, he's, he's just good at beating up big bodies, okay? Bowser, Dang. of course, no exception. Since the beginning of time, man? Since the beginning of time, there has been grime and crime, all right? <laughs> so here we go. Wiles right here looking like he wants to close this one out. But Blue Bell, of course, still in this thing, too. And both sides with their strongest tool. One side has Arson. One side is glowing red. Whose DLC is going to out-DLC the other side? Okay, Arson's out the picture. But I'm still glowing red, brother. It yeah. ain't done yet. And I ain't afraid. Runs right up, grabs him. Sorry, Joker. I'm in Fighter Pass 2, not 1. That's See right. <laughs> <laughs> Mine's last a little longer here, but the directional air dodge just surely should be it. Tries to get the gun here. So Blue Bill trying to capitalize off of the directional air dodge. Not able to do so, but still gets a ton of damage. Side oh. coming through, and the back air barely closing it out, though. But I, you know, I'll give it up to Blue Bill trying to make the best of that edge guard and fights back with the up smash. That's right, man. Again, back air, not the fastest of the aerials, but definitely very safe on shield, too, and very dangerous off stays. Arson's back almost reset the recovery just to eat the receiving end of Akazia foot right there. Great stuff. Both sides not letting up at all when it comes to the onstage and offstage bout, but it was wild. That was just a little bit too much for Bluebell. Yeah, and I mean, it's very fun to watch Wilds play. I, I feel like most Kazuyas will go ahead and just take the ledge trap, right? Yes. You have so much options in that situation. Like you said, when you have someone cornered, it is very, very strong and favorable for Mr. Mishima himself. But sometimes Kazuya get a little offhand dirt on the hands, right? Just getting a little dirty off stage, and yeah, I mean, did an incredible job. I love how Wilds would run off stage, stall with the double.